Hey guys and girls, in this tutorial I'm going to teach you how to install roguelike adventures and dungeons mod pack for Minecraft fast and easy. Let's get started. Also, make sure you watch this tutorial until the end because I'm going to teach you how to solve some issues you might have while installing this mod pack. Let's go ahead and click on the first link in the description of this video, which will bring you over here to this website where we're going to download CurseForge. Go ahead and click on download. CurseForge is a launcher that we need to install any Minecraft mod pack. Let's go ahead and drop the installer into the desktop. As we can see, the installer downloaded on the bottom left, drop it into the desktop and we can go ahead and close the website right now and go ahead and launch installer double click on it that is going to bring this app in here where we're going to click next then we're going to click next again just give it some time to load also it might ask you for administrator's permission go ahead and allow it it's completely safe go ahead and click that you have read and accepted the terms click next click next and just let it install. Once CurseForge has installed, it's going to bring up this website. That means that it has installed successfully. Go ahead and close the website and we could click on launch right here or we could launch it from the new icon that has been created on the desktop. Go ahead and click on that. Whatever way you prefer to launch it, it's okay. Just go ahead and launch it. Give it some time to load because it is the first time you're launching it. Let's just go ahead and wait for it to launch. And there we go, it has finally launched. Now in here, it's going to prompt you with an intro. It's going to ask if you want to have like a little tutorial. You could go ahead and skip that. Go ahead and click on skip intro. Because I'm going to teach you what to do. Go ahead and select that game that you're installing the mod pack for. Obviously it is minecraft so go ahead and click on minecraft and then in here you're probably not going to see any mod pack right your screen in here is going to be empty because you don't have any mod pack yet go ahead and click on browse mod pack on the top and in here we could scroll down until we find the mod pack that we're looking for or we could type it here on the search bar like so go ahead and type rogue i always just type rogue and rogue like adventures and dungeons is the first one to come up go ahead and click install now as we can see in here well i don't know if you guys got to see but it says 1.12.2 that is because rogue like adventures and dungeons runs on minecraft 1.12.2 which means that we need to install the right version of java for this mod pack to work if our java is java 18th this mod pack won't work so how do we get the right version of java don't worry go ahead and click on that second link in the description which will bring you over here to this website and in here we're going to scroll down until we see windows offline 64 bit go ahead and click on that and that is going to immediately start the download for java 8 in here in the bottom left as we can see let's just wait for that to finish downloading and as we can see it has finished let's go ahead and drop it into the desktop i'm going to drag it in here we could delete the curse first installer we don't need it anymore and now we, we could install it. let's go ahead and install it go ahead and click on it and just install java 8 this sign is going to come up go ahead and click on install and just let it install we need to make sure that we only have java 8 so in order to get rid of any other version of java go ahead and click on your search bar down here type add or remove programs and then in here we're going to type java in the search list and as we can see we have two javas right now we have java 8 and we have java 18 so what we need to do is delete the java 18 in order for the java 8 to work right away go ahead and click on java 18 and delete it uninstall it maybe you have 17 maybe you have a different version the only one that you need right now is java 8 let's go ahead and close that in the background that is the successful installation for java 8 and also let's just wait for java 18 to uninstall here's the thing if you ever want to play any newer mod pack for minecraft any version above 1.16.5 you're going to need to reinstall java 18 if you want to play newer versions of modern minecraft that is the only side problem i see but it is what it is that is a way to solve it right now it's just to be switching between the javas i hate it too don't worry anyways once we only have java 8 we are ready to launch our mod pack as we can see it has finished installing let's go ahead and click play now if you didn't downgrade java to java 8 you might have some problems trying to launch this mod pack anyways once we click on play minecraft launcher is gonna come up just go ahead and sign in with your credentials for minecraft java and then in here we could click play and it's going to prompt you with the sign go ahead and click that you understand the risks and that is it and as we can see after like a whole minute of this loading up we are finally in the mod pack it works let's just go ahead and create a new world i'm just gonna leave it like that and as we can see we're in the mod pack that is me that is my skin and yeah that is it guys that is it for the tutorial i hope you enjoyed it and as always Bye-bye.